Hey, what's going on? Barnaby here. Another Hello Life moment. This one having to do with allergies because, man, have you noticed? More and more people seem allergic to things these days. And so joining us now is our registered dietitian, Jessica Butcher, in this Hello Life moment. So how many allergies are there these days? You know what? Anything with a protein in it, we can be allergic to, but there are eight that cause 50 to 90% of the most severe reactions in the United States. And so there are eight of the most common food allergy reactions that we do have. But you know what's funny is, we say, I'm allergic, when actually we might just be intolerant. That certainly could be the case, but there's big differences between intolerance and an allergy. Now if you have an intolerance like lactose intolerance, that's typically just, you know, you're going to have the gas, the bloating, the indigestion. It's going to be just based on your gastrointestinal tract. So what about an allergy? Is that just a full body reaction? It is. It's going to incorporate a lot more systems. It's an immune system response in your body. So if you do have a severe reaction, you could have your throat swelling up, you could have hives, you could have a true anaphylactic shot where, you know, you simply just can't breathe. That's where it can be so severe that it may be a fatal reaction. Alrighty, and you know, it's interesting because there is a difference between adults and kids when it comes to allergies, and there's so much ground to cover here. Why don't we break it up into manageable chunks? You want to do that? We certainly can. Okay, so we've got the top eight, 50 to 90 percent of all allergies are these, and so for that, we're going to break it up into manageable chunks in ensuing segments of HelloLife.net, because you've come to the right place for good information. Have you noticed? HelloLife.net, we're all about matching your commitment to a healthy lifestyle.